This is a LibriVox recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For more information, or to volunteer, please visit LibriVox.org. Recorded by Christine Dewar, Thanona Sassa, Florida. Aesop's Fables The Peacock and Juno The peacock was greatly discontented, because he had not a beautiful voice like the nightingale and he went and complained to Juno about it. The nightingale's song, he said, is the envy of all the birds. But whenever I utter a sound, I become a laughing-stock. The goddess tried to console him by saying, You have not, it is true, the power of song. But then you far excel all the rest in beauty. Your neck flashes like the emerald, and your splendid tail is a marvel of gorgeous color. But the peacock was not appeased. "'What is the use,' he said, "'of being beautiful with a voice like mine?' Then Juno replied, with a shade of sternness in her tones, "'Fate has allotted to all their destined gifts. To yourself beauty, to the eagle strength, to the nightingale song, and so on to all the rest in their degree. But you alone are dissatisfied with your portion.' Make then no more complaints, for if your present wish were granted, you would quickly find cause for fresh discontent. End of the Peacock and Juno